Hi everyone, how are you? Where are you? We got the three of swords. That's actually a very pretty three of swords, Jason. For, for being such a like painful. Hi, scruffy part. girl. It's like. <gasps> but you have one of the more prettier three of swords. I don't think it's my true. three of swords is as pretty. Hi guys. Are you jealous? I'm always jealous, Jason. Are you jealous? That I'm jealous three and competitive. Of swords is like yes. Pretty. It's a pretty card. For, for being such Hi, a... Hi, intuitive waters. Hi, scruffy girl lesson. again. Wait, I want to compare your three of swords with my three of swords. Say hi to whoever. Oh. Three of swords is bloody. You know oh, what? did you see it? No, it's, no, no. no. It's, that's it's, it's bloody. Actually, it's actually not. Not in this deck. The wizard's tarot. Hello. The wizard's tarot. Wow, I am like really... Like, Why are you so low there? What happened? Well, it's it's the, the oh, placement I know. of the camera. I know. I'll fix it. Okay, this is my three of swords. Now mine looks scary. If you wanna, if you want scary, I'll give you scary. That's, that's pretty scary looking. Yeah. There, and it's got like bumblebees and fairies, and it's not good. It's not good. This, and the fairies is... look like they're dying. Well, this person looks like he's trying to save her from the from the three from the. Swords, but this one looked like it got stabbed by because I got fairies in here, and this one is like two together. But it looks like he's trying to save right. this one from getting in the midst of this three of swords. But this one looked like it got stuck by one of the swords there. So go back to yours, Jason. Yours is <clears throat> his is prettier than mine. I like you know, in the light, it's gold up here. Like that, right? I like that. Yeah, it is pretty. I love that. Cold. But look at the background. There's a lot of rain, and rain means. Are you talking to me? Yeah. <laughs> well, I see the inclement weather, which is just kind of that that stormy, stormy. weather that that's inside of us. Yes. You know, that that is like um, the the emotional turmoil. Yes. That uh, takes place within inside of us. You you think it's tears? You think the rain is tears? Oh, no, no. I think the rain represents how we feel when something is so emotional, like broken love, and we just did get all depressed, and we got to pull the covers over our head because we're just, oh, my God, how could this happen? You know, this is actually a very beautiful card in, in the sense that there, there is an aspect of where we can fix that which is broken. That's you know, right. If, if there is, if someone is experiencing a broken heart, that's it's right. like uh, one can actually take the steps to to fix their their broken heart, but it does require that you know one does the work. Yeah. Unless, of course, one of us is available for a reading, we can fix you magically. <laughs> but I like what you said there because sometimes I tell my people that enjoy the depression, go in, don't fight it, just. Cry. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Take a week off. Will you do a reading on Metal Walker? Oh, damn it. I was supposed to. What happened? Metal what happened Walker is Paul Walker's daughter, and she is suing the car maker Porsche. Oh, right, 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 right. For, for him probably driving too fast, right? <laughs> and too furiously. Although he wasn't the one driving. It's his friend was, He wasn't the one driving. Uh, but, but he was driving. They were driving I, I, I don't fast. know. Oh, and Halle Berry. Actually, guys, I'm looking for the Halle Berry. I actually did a blog talk radio. By the way, um, 12, wait, 12 noon for me on this Saturday is blog talk radio. And <clears throat> are, are am, you taking? I am Thursdays at Thursdays three. at 3 on blog, on blog talk, talk radio. I have so. a, a lawyer guest this week. And she is going to kick ass. Kick ass. That's right. But in any case, um, the Harry Bailey one, Harry ba Harry, Haley. Hey, Hallie. Hallie. <laughs> uh, Harry Potter. <laughs> Halle Berry. Halle Berry one. I did that. I think I saw her divorce. I'm going to post it. So I'm going to post it to Twitter and then post it to the pop culture public Facebook page. And then post it to my own personal page. I was looking for it this morning, but I got to find it someplace else. I did it, I think, in July of last year. What did Porsche have to do with the accident? Nothing. They happened to be in a Porsche when they were going, what, 90 miles an hour down a side street and, and wrapped it into a tree. They wrapped the car into a tree. <clears throat> car I exploded. think metal is being... 
I mean, this isn't psychic yet, guys. This is just common talk. I think Metal is being coerced to do this. Meanwhile, Paul left millions of dollars to her. Why is anybody suing anybody? But let me do my investigation on what this lawsuit is really about, and then we'll look to see if she'll win. Yes. Well, come on. Oh, look at that. Who would take that case? Anybody with money. Okay. So <laughs> yeah. Oh, it might no. be for you. God damn it. <laughs> Hello? Thank you. Hi, Mary? Not bad, thank you. How are you? Oh, honey, I'm so sorry. Just give me one second, okay? Don't you dare hang up. Okay, hold on. I feel so bad. Oh, I think I hung up on her. It's your something. Okay, Something's let's not worry happening. about it. I think I did something wrong. Emmanuel Aman 8, I like your name. My church is Emmanuel. Guys, look. These are my scars. And they belong to me. And they are going to represent Imala. No. M no. M Malala. Malala. <laughs> I, I added Emmanuel with yeah, Malala and gave I, I, I Imala. Ma um, Malala. Malala. I am representing Malala. From and, Pakistan. Right. The one that won the Nobel Peace Prize because I think that all women around the world, our new look should represent Malala. <laughs> and we should all be wearing scarves now. To show our uh, support. That's a good look for you. Thank you. Are you going to wear that tonight on your date? That would be amazing. That would be amazing. By the way. You totally should. I have a date. Not with me. You pointed to me. It's like. <laughs> no, no one pointed no. to you, Jason. <laughs> 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 no one pointed to you. <laughs> I have a date tonight after work. Not my favorite time to go on a date after work. No. Nah. No, because you know, after working a, a long day in the psychic salt mines, they're hard work. It's like... Uh, Do it! Follow me. Let's support Malala this winter. Everyone should be wearing scarves like this this winter. And it doesn't have to be like this. I'm saying everyone should have the look, Malala's look. Because she has a movie coming out, and the name of the movie is I Am Malala. And I think it's time to support... Malala and all women that aren't paid enough. No, these are only five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. Five ninety nine. We be. should women that are not paid enough. Paid. Yeah. Women that get treated badly by their boyfriends, their husband. Like we need to start supporting each other. And I think this look is very, very symbolic, not of a religion, but of the problems in the world that all women face across the country. I am Malala. Well said. Oh, thank well you. Said. So, with that being said, I do date. Even though I'm going to be like Malala, I date. <laughs> well, Malala, I'm sure, will date at some point. Well, I mean, she's like 18. 19, it has to be like, like organized by her dad, I'm sure. It has to be like. Really? That's her religion. You just can't date. You have to. Is the it? people have to pick yeah, it. Yeah, she seems to be pretty independent. Pretty. Like outspoken, as far as I but can see, but there has her. to be some tradition involved. I can't imagine she's going to go out and date I, like a regular teenager. I don't, know. I don't even think the Obama children going to be able to date well, like regular that's people. Different. Why is that different? Because there are like rules a, and regulations. A, a, under, you know, Secret Service protection. Mm -hmm. You know. Oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I'll let you guys know next week how it went. Um, oh, there, I can't be Malala because the damn thing doesn't stay on. <laughs> well, so much for that. <laughs> and I curse. <laughs> and that. Um, so, so did we talk about uh, anything other than your reading that you have? <laughs> I know I'm going to be in trouble in a minute. Yes. So, guys, it's mu wait. I didn't see that. Following your scarf. Yeah, I should wear the scarf tonight. I should really shock him and come Absolutely. out with the scarf. Absolutely. Why Actually, not? I'm going to do that. I'm going to wear the scarf tonight on my date. <laughs> Put him to the test. 
put him, Why put him not? Right, he right, needs right. to know that I come from a different mold. And I should see if he's ready to accept. Tracy comes from a way different mold. <laughs> from a different mold. All right, hold on a second. I'm so rude. Damn it. I had a funny feeling when I did that something went wrong. I, unplugging anything is probably a bad idea. <laughs> it's just like... Not a good idea. Not, not good. All right, guys. Actually, this is the, the thing that you wear around your waist. It's the belly dancing thing that you wear around your waist. It really is. But. How, how am I supposed to know that? <laughs> but. But you can do I it think it's prettier dress. this way. Yeah, it's very pretty that way. Right? Okay, Jason. And every time you, you shake your head and all that, it's like, uh, you know. <laughs> Different. Is there a customer waiting? Yes. Yes. Yes, Greg. Okay. You can send him up. I'm sorry. It's on the phone. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, Thank it's you. phone? It's a phone. Oh, Thank okay. You. Thank you. Right. Thank you, Griffin. Okay. <laughs> Wait till the phone rings again. Um, call us for your own personal readings. 818-985-2010. Jason, thank you for explaining the Three of Swords in your deck. Did I explain it? Let's explain it one more time so we can get the gist of the Three of Swords from your perspective. Uh-oh, you see, I got into trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Go ahead. Uh, from, from, well, Go ahead. there it Go is. Ahead. Let me hear it. All right, so, so from my perspective, the Three of Swords is... A place where Hearts. one's desires are, are you're fighting like your, your thoughts about it. The oh. mind is fighting the heart. Oh. So it's about bringing balance back into the two. So so one can bring uh, you know peace back into into one's one's life. Take those damn swords out. That's right. Take the swords out. So eight one eight nine eight five two zero one zero. That's Jason. This is Tracy. I love you guys. Bye.